Good morning, Charlestown. Good morning. Come on, good morning. Guys, stir up a little. We are in a gymnasium, for goodness sakes. Could we have a little noise here? Good morning. All right, all right. Good, good. So, Commissioner Freeland, thank you very much. I appreciate this. Principal Thomas, it's good to be here. I came with my own special uh, emissary uh, from Charlestown High. Jason, where are you? There he is. See the guy with the fancy hanky in his pocket? The one over there? This is a Charlestown High grad who now runs all of Boston for my Senate office. Way to go, Charlestown High. <laughs> Woo! I also want to do a special shout out for those debaters. I just want to say, ladies, I was a high school debater. Debaters rock. Uh, way to go. Way to go. That's right. That's right. Okay, so you've had the news flash. College costs a lot of money. I know you were all shocked. You kind of came here thinking that wasn't so. Well, it's so. The point is, we're going to help you find some of that money, or maybe all of the money that you need to go to college. There's lots of money out there. There are Pell Grants, there are other grants, there are loans, there's work study, there's state money, there's federal money, there's private money, but you got to do one thing to get the money fill out the form. So we're going to do a little question and answer while I talk to you this morning. How much money do you get if you don't fill out the form? Oh, let me hear you again. I can't hear you. How much money do you get? Let's do it again. How much money do you get if you don't fill out the form? Good, good. So we're doing the math here. How much money do you get if you don't fill out the form? All right. I like this. I like this. Is the form complicated? Yes. Are there people who will help you? Yes. The point is to get through the form because if you don't fill out the form, how much money do you get? No. Okay, all right. You're not sure you're going to college? Then keep your options open. The best way to keep your options open is to fill out the form so you know how much financial aid you can get. Because how much money do you get if you don't fill out the form? No. Okay, we're getting a message here, all right. So, I want to say this. You see this? Nearly 30%, nearly one in three people who graduates from high school is not filling out the form. It's not smart not to fill out the form. You're leaving money on the table if you don't fill out the form. So what we want to do is get everybody to fill out the form. Now, I just want to say something about this. I'm your senior senator from Massachusetts. I was not born a senior senator from Massachusetts. My dad was a maintenance man. My mom worked the phones at Sears. I went to a commuter college. I got by on grants and loans and scholarships. That's what helped me go through college. I wouldn't have been there if I hadn't had help. And let me tell you what I did when I was 16 years old. I filled out the form because that's what it takes to get the money. So here's the deal. You're smart people. You got ideas. You're thinking about college. So if you're thinking about college, what do you want to do? Uh, I can't hear you. <laughs> you're thinking about college. What do you want to do? You're not sure about college, but you might go to college. What do you want to do? You're not thinking about college, but your mama's thinking about college for you. What do you want to do? Okay, guys, we got to fill out the form. I know it sounds repetitive, but it's hard to get out there and do this. This is one of the first things, woo! This is one of the first things you do as a real grown-up who's going to take care of your own future. You got to get out there and fill out the form. I'm going to do my part in Washington. You're going to do your part right here in Charlestown. Fill out the form. 